Hi YouTubers, it's me, Zipster. Here we are, Friday night, you know. Ever since I kind of um, met this dude, my friend Bob, he's been coming over every Friday night for like eight years now. You know, and even when my gay boyfriend was alive, it was okay, because he worked like till really late on a Friday night, because he was a waiter, and whatever. So, gay Bob comes over, ooh, I'm sorry. I thought I just called him Bob before, but he turned into gay Bob somewhere along the way, but I don't have anything to do with him, not that it's any of your business. Because it's not the kind of relationship. But, so, um, you know, he comes over and we play like Mahjong or, uh, you know, Backgammon, Scrabble. And uh, so he came over tonight and he was like 10 minutes, 10 minutes, 20 minutes. I don't know. He was really early. So I'm like sitting up here and I'm doing all my YouTube business, you know, because, you know, you have emails to answer and you have videos to make and you have, you know, all this business to do. And I'm like, oh my God, he's 20 minutes early. And he comes flopping upstairs and he sits down and I'm like, okay, I'll be with you in a minute. And he's like, well, I'm here now. I'm like, well, yeah, I said I'd be with you in a minute. And like, I took the 20 minutes that I had because I knew that was how long it was going to take to do this with YouTube. Okay, so what? So we sit down and we're playing a game of Scrabble and um, I keep getting emails from like my YouTube people and I have to like turn around and quickly, it's like, it'll just take me a minute and I have to like say, oh, you know, thank you for subscribing to my channel and whatever. Then I would turn around and we would play the game. And then at the end, uh, you know, like it, at the end of the game, I'm like, oh my God, you have to see this, this guy, uh, that Carl Daly ate one because he's so funny. So I, you know, I'm playing the stuff for him and all of a sudden he looks like at me and I'm like, you have to understand my, my friend Gay Bob works professionally with like, um, um, mentally, you know, challenged people with all sorts of, you know, disorders, everything from, you know, the best to the worst, like if there is a best. And all of a sudden he said to me, you know what, I, I gotta tell you something, Zip, I'm getting a little worried. I'm like, what are you talking about? And he's like, um, I think, I, I, I wrote this down on paper because I knew I'd never remember it. He said, I think you're starting to put yourself in social is isolation. How, you know, that intrigued me because how can isolation be social if you're isolated? He's like, no, 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 what's happening is I wrote it down. I'm getting, oh, he said agoraphobia. Hello, I already knew that. I, you know, I, well, that's no news, but at least he didn't charge me. What the hell does this? I need new glasses. Oh, socialized anxiety disorder with psychotic features, which he told me he did not think I had psychotic features. I was very happy about that. Dissociative identity disorder used to be called multiple personality disorder but they had to change it because multiple personality people all of their people can be in touch with each, with each other you know what i'm saying but on uh, dissociative identity disorder all your people in your head they don't even know each other they don't even know you okay that's scary i'm glad i just have the regular multiple personality because at least i can talk to all these people Okay, I'm really going on again, and I shouldn't have, but you know how I am when I get wound up. I love you. Thank you.